Hello, it's Joyce and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's video, I'm going to unbox this BTS Season Greetings na nakuha ko kanina lang. Actually, tagal na itong na-release noong December something pa. But, ayun nga, since ang daming holidays na umano yung... Anyways, I'll be unboxing. And sorry kung medyo nakikita niya yung... Nagkaroon ng sira yung aircon ko. Something sa host niya. Pa patungong pababa. Patungong pababa. Pababa na yung... Yung host niya para dun sa tubig. So, ang ginawa, tinanggal na lang namin yung host and nag-improvise na lang ng ganyan. So, anyways, babalik na lang pala ako. Ganyan. And as you can see, here's my new cabinet. Actually, ito yung parang not really the one I'm expecting for sa cabinet na paglalagyan ko ng mga collection ko, ng mini collection ko ng BTS. But ito lang kasi yung nakita ko sa IKEA sa Pasay. So, ayan na lang. And pinadeliver ko siya. So, mamaya, tignan natin. But, first, buksan muna natin po. Actually, uh, every year ako nagko-collect ng planner sa Starbucks. But, ayan nga, when I finally decided na I'll be getting the BTS Christmas greeting ng 2022, hindi na ako nagbalak na kumuha sa Starbucks na planner. So, ayan, di ako mo siya mag And imagine, hindi ko alam kung nagmahal ba yung cargo fee sa STS. But anyways, hindi ko lang mag-gets na nasa 2 kilos pala yung season speeding. So, so every box na kukunin mo sa weavers is ganito. And obviously, nung nalaman ko yung STS warehouse or STS ng forwarding company from Korea, hindi na ako masyadong nabili sa mga resellers. As I mentioned, feeling ko sa maraming videos na since nga, mas gusto ko yung direct and nakuha kasi agad yung items pag nandito na sa Philippines. So, this is how it looks like. And laki niya pala. Kalang maliit lang siya. By the way, this is my first uh, BTS Seasons greeting kasi last year di ako bumili. And one of the things na gusto kong makita sa isang uh, BTS Seasons greeting or any like winter package, summer package or anything like that is yung practicality niya para sa akin na hindi lang, kasi ako, hindi ako mahilig sa postcards. Like, mas gusto ko yung may digital copy, like the memories of 2020, ganyan. Ayun. So, mas gusto ko yung may practicality siya kaysa yung puro pictures lang. Kasi medyo hindi ako mahilig sa mga ganon. Mas gusto ko talaga yung mga videos rather than, like, photo books, ganyan. So, I'll be opening this up. So, medyo pumababa po yung angle natin. So, baka nagtataka kayo, ba't hindi ako kumuha ng calendar? Kasi, like, mas gusto ko yung maliit na calendar rather sa wall calendar. And mahal din kasi yung wall calendar. Nasa 1.5 din ata. So, ayan. This is how it looks like. <laughs> Nago cheap. So, let's open this up. So, parang ganun lang. Here comes the things na included sa kanya. Wait. Let's... Ito lahat yung maaking nakuha. Ayan. So, ito, we have this parang pocket siya. Sorry, medyo wala ako sa Wisho since nagpa-booster kasi kami kahap. Ito pala yung parang ID. And, dito, bakit ayaw niya mag-focus? Ayan. So, let's choose, ano, Jimin, since yun yung bias natin sa BTS. With this side, it looks like... Then, we have this. Alam ko, this is like a note. Like a memo page. Na parang, like, record yung design. Ganyan siya. Actually, dapat bukas pa ako mag-unbox nyan to. But then, I couldn't help myself na hindi i-unbox. Dahil gustong-gusto ko na makakuha ng planner nila. Dahil, Today is something like January 12. So, 12 days na ako hindi nagsusulat sa planner. So, feeling ko this is the photo card. Ah! So, this card contains yung parang digital ano niya, digital video niya. So, hindi yun na siya naka CD. Actually, ang tagal ko lang nakuha itong memories of 2020. But then, sobrang busy lang sa school. Kahit nasuspend na yung klase namin for about 2 weeks now. Like, siguro nasa 1 month na ako nagbabakasyo. Ito naman, photo cards. Ulit. This is how it looks like. Actually, parang e ASMR na nga sana. But then, I wanted you guys to see my mini collection of BTS. So, sabi ko, i-vlog ko na lang at sa point. This is the memo with regards sa digital code ng user guide. So, yeah. Next, we have this photo cards. Ayan. 
Ah, parang ano lang pala siya. Wow, ah. Sobrang solid naman nito. So, parang this one is a clear one. So, parang picture style. Like that. So, let's see. We have Jin here. So, anyways, since alam niyo na yun, si Jin, yun yung G. Yung asok, kaki min, teo. Saka, dyan yung po. Ito ata yung like personalized sa every collection. This is like a magnetic something. Yan siya, tapos parang, ayan, something like that. Parang magazine nga siya. Grabe ang quality masyado. So, here naman, we have parang magazine but in a more sophisticated. Ayan, parang natatanggal din siya. Wow, dyan po. May bias record. Grabe! Ah, puro ano pala to. Puro poster pala. It's not a magazine, but a poster. Pero style magazine lang siya. I have this parang notebook. So, feeling ko this is the one. So, naata yung planner. So, gusto ko talaga ng planner na bago. But, yun nga, hindi ko rin kasi bet yung nasa Starbucks. And, na-order ko na to bago pa dumating yung sa Starbucks. Ayan, finally. Yay! Yun siya. And, we have these sticker tattoos. So, it looks like. And, of course, the one I've been waiting for is this desk calendar. Dahil ilalagay ko dito sa standing desk ko yung calendar. Kasi pag one calendar siya, parang wala rin silbi sa akin. Kaya, nag-opto na lang talaga ako dito. Saka mas nakamura ako at sa point. So, ayan. We have here yung Taeyong for the January. And then, we have the Yung line. Ah, joke. This is the Yung line. This is the Makna line. Makna pero kasama si J-Hope. Ang ganda naman. Sobrang quality. Saka may nakalagay, oh. Like, for example, this one. March. Suga birthday. Ayan siya. We have Jimin. Grabe, ang ganda. I'm excited to use this. So, anyways, that is all for the season's greeting. So, ito hindi ko na siya itatabi pa. Kasi gagamitin ko na silang dalawa the planner and also the this calendar. So, this remaining like the magazines and all, I'll be keeping them inside the box. Ayan. So, anyways, this is how my cabinet looks like. As you can see, I have the pre-order benefits ng Memories of 2020. Rearrange natin ngayon since nga nadagdag this um, season's greeting. Actually, dapat ang gagawin ko bago ko ipakita sa inyo is parang kompletuhin ko lahat ng rare na like DVDs nila but then sobrang pamahala ng pamahal and I think it's not worth it anymore. Like worth it siya at some point but yung price range niya parang hindi naman dapat ganong katataas. Sabi ko, I will opt na lang sa mga like this one yung mga ilalabas talaga nila. Kasi, like, feeling ko yung mga bago, mas worthy siya and nagpapamahal yung price. So, yun. It's kind of what, like, investment piece. <laughs> Ganon. So, here, you will see agad yung MOTS special edition siya ng official lightstick SE. So, hindi ko na bubuksan kasi feeling ko alam niyo naman kung anong laman niya. And, obviously, here, nakalimutan ko yung tawag sa ganito, but ito yung kasama dun sa third album, like yung discography album niya. And then, ito na yung mga sinasabi kong rare albums. First, I have this, The Wings Tour na DVD. Uh, nakuha ko to in around 1,300. Ang wala lang dito, photo card and also yung parang poster something. So, pero kompleto siya and kompleto yung uh, CD. Actually, kung naghahanap kayo ng mga rare albums, I will suggest na find sa Facebook Marketplace. And thankfully naman, never pa ako na-scam doon. <laughs> Kasi feeling ko, pag sa Facebook Marketplace kayo bumili, is the price is so much, much lower. Actually, ang selling price na ito ngayon is nasa 5,000 to 8,000. Depends pa kung ano yung photocard na kasama. As I mentioned a while ago, mas gusto ko yung napapakinabangan talaga. So, okay lang sa akin na wala yung photocard. Pero, di ba, mas okay kung kompleto siya. So, nakuha ko to sa Twitter lang ako ng TS The Wings Store for sale na DVD. Kasi mas mura ang DVD kasi sa Blu-ray. And also, wala akong like, 
Blu-ray player, something like that. Next is the, ito na, Map of the Soul one. Actually, I've ordered this Weavers nung nilabas nila. Ayan. Papapap ko dito yung aking unboxing with regards to this one. Next, I have this BTS World Tour Love Yourself, Speak Yourself in Wembley. London. Next, one of the rare is this. So, wala na siyang, as you can see, oh, medyo worn out na yung kulay niya. But this the Love Yourself BTS Tour in Seoul. So, actually, I bought this in around, alam ko na, sa, umabot ako ng 3,000 kasama tong Fort Master. So, I bought this too sa Facebook Marketplace. Ang inclusions na ito, actually, kulat na kulat ako kasi sobrang kompleto and I have a preview pa. Kompleto yung inclusions niya. I've only buy this at around 2,100. <laughs> Tapos, like, ang selling price niya is more than, like, actually lahat talagang 5,000 and up. Minsan hindi pa siya kompleto. So, ito, worn out lang yung box but kompleto yung inside niya. Like, all of the CDs are still going. And then, the next one, since pinakita ko na, is the BTS Third Master na ARMY SIP. Dapat hindi ko pa to bibilhin. Kasi nga, like, Iniisa-isa ko and wala kong funds. But then, the seller offered me na no, 1.5 niya na lang ito ibibigay sa akin. And also, this one, it comes with a complete inclusions. Like, legit na complete talaga. So, ayan siya. So, I bought this for a very, very low price. So, as you can see, kung naghahanap ka ng rare albums is I research and mostly kasi ng mga K-pop stores is mataas yung patong. Minsan, yung kantong album is around 7,000. Hanap na lang din talaga. Nahili ko kasi ito nung nag-form months akong bakasyon. So, I have more time to research, to search, ganyan. And if, kunwari, may nakita kayong picture, I suggest na um, ask for more pictures sa authenticity nyo. Or kung hindi kayo masyadong satisfied, you can go for a cash and delivery na item. Next, since napag-usapan na natin lahat ng mga like DVD, so pagtuloy ko na, so nandito kasi yung remaining, I have also, I know pala, ang kasama ko palang bilhin to is this Fort Master Happy Ever After. This is also a complete inclusion. Worn out lang siya. Basta worn out lang yung box like this one. But, complete inclusion siya and lahat ng DVDs is still working. And so, separate ko pa na ito nabili. Itong uh, third master. Next, I have the Fifth Master, which is the Magic Shop. So, ito, I bought this sa... I forgot the name ng store. But, ito yung nag-restock sila by the time na Bang Bang Con last year. Nag-restock yung Weavers. And one of the K-pop sellers na I've been following sa Instagram secured almost three. So, I bought this at around 2,000 something plus. Ayan lang. So, ayun siya. Kasi more on, pag na-resell na siya, nasa 5,000. School Love Affair na special edition. This is, by the way, from the Soul Stop. Ito yung unang-una kong purchase as an army. Ayan siya. And also, I have my memories of 2020. And this one, actually, this is a brand new. nag stock si Weavers. Tapos, nag-search ako sa Twitter ng nagbebenta ng Memo 2021 at the low price at the reasonable price. So, nakita ko tong person na to na nagsasabi na sinasal niya Memo 2018 niya. Ang habol niya lang kasi is photocard. So, nung dumating to sa kanya, yung photocard lang yung inalis niya. And then, she already packed this for me. Ayun. So, nabili ko lang to at around 1,980. Ayan. Pero complete inclusion siya. Ang wala lang talaga is yung photocard. And next is this BTS Memories of 2019. This is one of the uh, big purchases ko nung nag-STS Logistics ako na delivery. And also, this army sip, alam ko army, ayun, army membership kit. It, this is from Ate Ashley. Pero parang halo-halo na siya kasi may 2020 seasons greeting dito. Let's fix this like lower proportion muna. Bago tayo po manik sa discography albums. Actually, may nahanap pa akong 2017 na memories. And they only sell it at 2,000 pesos. But ayun nga, since my funds sa BTS is pong uti ng low ubo. So I opted to like, bought the brand new ones rather than the rare ones. Kasi yung mahal din talaga. Like, makakabili ka na ng ilang albums. Babay hide ko na lang. So, kunin ko na itong pinakamalaking album. This is the Mod 7 album. Alam ko, this is version 4. Ayan, nabili ko to kay Soul Stop PH. I've also got this, Young Forever. So, nakita nyo na rin to dun sa BTS Hall. So, ang kulang lang dito sa Master, since nga super rare na yung ibang albums, Ang kulang lang dito is yung Memories of 2014 since nandun yung unang master. And then, 
Yung second master, I think, nasa memories of 2016. So, wala din ako noon. <laughs> Kasi nga pamahal na sila ng pamahal. And then, sa discography album, kulang lang ako dito ng mga first um, first albums nila. But, Love Yourself series is kompleto. Love Yourself Her, Love Yourself Answer, and then Love Yourself Peer. And kompleto. And then, next is the Map of the Soul Persona. And then, I also have this The Most Beautiful Moment in Life, Part 1 and Part 2. I've also got this. Actually, this is a freebie. Nung nabili ko yung Wings Tour. So, this is the B. Yung parang second edition niya. And then, also, the second purchase I bought from BTS is this B album. I bought this sa Kaisos. So, that is it for this video, guys. I hope you guys like it. Ang aking mini collection, but hopefully soon. I hope you guys like this video. Please give it a big thumbs up and comment below kung anong nagustuhan nyo or any video suggestions. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Damn.